it's going. It is going. Well, here we are. <laughs> I married Sue's over 30, 30 years, years ago. ago. Isn't that right? Yes, yeah, it's been 30 years. The most beautiful girl in the world that I saw walking down that aisle at St. Peter's Episcopal Church. Isn't that right, honey? That's right, that's right. Yeah. And then uh, we left and went to the British Isles for our uh, honeymoon. And we had our first argument. Remember that? I do. <laughs> I had been driving on the wrong side of the road all day long. And we didn't have a place to stay. I finally found us a beautiful country inn mm-hmm. where the room was nice and looking out on the sheep and the cows and everything. Remember that? Mm-hmm. I do, dear. I and do. they had a nice uh, dining room there, too. Remember yes. That? Mm-hmm. <laughs> and then I ordered dinner. And Susan ordered, had the audacity. And Susan ordered the exact same thing I did, and that made me so mad. Wasn't that awful? Yeah, it's awful. So we had a horrible argument, and I cried in the restaurant. And she cried. Well, but we got over it. That was 30 years ago. But things more recently happen, you know. One thing that happens is that I have some favorite things. Earphones, I have a lot of connections I make. And I leave them where I want them so I can find them. Inevitably, when I go out, I come back and they're gone. And mm-hmm. Susan, I say, Susan, where Because is, you lose everything all the time. Where are my headphones? Where, where are my connections? Well, she says, I put them up. I said, well, fine. I said, well, where are they? Where did you put them? She says, I don't remember. Right. Yeah. Because everything is black and has a wire on it. <laughs> well, yes. Yes. So Frost asked me to think of just a couple things about him that irritate me. Not many, <laughs> not many are there. <laughs> uh, of course, we have the usual, the commode thing. What's com- what commode? The commode thing? seat thing. Mm-hmm. In 30 years, he has never closed a cabinet or a drawer. I have slammed my face into cabinet doors in the middle of the night. He never tightens the uh, cap on anything, and I shake everything before I use it. So, the result of that is I have many times slung ketchup in my face. That's one. Yeah, but the what about... The cabinet door thing. He snores like a weed eater. I do, though. Yes, you do. Well, what about the commode seat? I don't understand that. Now, what makes you so irritated about that? <laughs> a broken <laughs> back and a wet fanny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I never realized that was happening. Um, But, anyway... These are small things. But in spite of all these things and some bright larger things. Too, no, they're no larger things. Lar- right, larger <laughs> challenges. We're still in love and I still think she's the most beautiful girl in the world. And actually one thing I would say to all uh, that are, are willing to take the big leap and jump off into marriage is uh, you've got to be friends first. Yes, best friends. If you are best friends you will make the next 30 years. And you have to laugh at everything. And you have to... Just can't imagine your life without the other person. That's the main That's main thing, too. That's the main thing. And friendship, because you get old and... <laughs> you have a lot of the old problems, I'm telling you that. It has to be tolerated by each... <laughs> The old problems, well, but you kids don't have to worry in. about that. You got anyway, a bad stomach, you have to have colonoscopies. Okay, that's enough. That's okay. enough. That's See enough. See that, what I'm telling you? <laughs> Bye. We love, but we love each other, right? Congratulations, hey, Catherine what? and Dave. It's your hand. You've got your hand in the picture. Well, I had to turn it off. It won't turn off. How do we turn it off?